and the White House physician says President Trump is undergoing a five day treatment with an experimental drug called remezivir. Studies have shown the experimental drug is one of the most effective ways to treat COVID-19, although it's not considered a cure. 11 Alive Shanu Her has more with a doctor from Emory University where that drug is being studied. President Donald Trump continues to fight COVID-19 at Walter Reed Hospital. And as of Friday night, doctors have given him a dose of remdesivir, a drug studied at Emory University starting back in February. There are some treatments that are now available under emergency use authorizations, and that includes remdesivir, and that includes convalescent plasma. Dr. Mary Beth Sexton is an Emory assistant professor of infectious disease. Although proven as an effective tool and to reduce hospital stays, Dr. Sexton says there are still many unknowns with remdesivir. Those are things that seem to shorten the course of symptoms for people. We don't know yet if they have a significant benefit on mortality, and we don't know yet at what point in the illness they're most effective. But it is good that we're starting to see things like that get developed. The White House said on Thursday President Trump's symptoms were mild. On Saturday, the White House physician said President Trump's symptoms were resolving and improving, and he's been fever free for 24 hours. Dr. Sexton says for most people with mild symptoms or are asymptomatic, doctors recommend supportive care. A lot of the time for mild symptoms or people who don't have symptoms, it's just what we call supportive care getting a lot of rest, drinking fluids, close monitoring. And we will continue to follow all the updates on the president's condition at 11alive.com and on the 11alive app. You can also find more about that drug there as well.